far from the rigorous outboard dash, the crew of the Slow Motion 4 have spent weeks readying their pet for a new assault on her own world speed record set in 1950. Her 12-cylinder Allison aircraft engine gets a careful last-minute grooming by the crew of mechanics who have helped Slow Motion 4 win more triumphs than any other racing boat has ever won. With fuel tanks already filled, the final topping off with mobile oil gets the critical attention that lubrication for this high-speed engine demands. Crash helmets and life jackets are required items under American Powerboat Association rules. Today's attempt at setting a new world speed record finds Stanley Sayers, the owner of both Slow Motion 4 and Slow Motion 5, again at the wheel of the four, with Elmer Linenschmidt riding as co-pilot mechanic. Two years ago, Sayers drove the same boat at the nearly unbelievable speed of over 160 miles per hour. His three-ton, 28-foot bolt of lightning is ready. The water is right. And from his home at Hunts Point on Lake Washington, they start for the measured mile. The slow mo's engine develops over 2,000 horsepower at 3,900 RPM, turning a small two-bladed propeller at nearly 12,000 revolutions per minute through a Pacific Western step-up gearbox. With all that power, she'll run away from most private planes. While slow-mo warms up, official referee Mel Crook and timer Art Shorey check the intricate electronic timing devices, capable of accurate clocking down to thousandths of a second over a mile course that has been precisely surveyed and marked by buoys. The rooster tail is flying. Slow motion four. What a contrary-wise name for such a roaring speedster. It ought to be named Comet or Rocket or goodness knows what, but... Slow motion. This short sprint of less than 20 seconds running time is being run at the fabulous rate of over 185 miles per hour, over three miles per minute. But it's not just one dash. It takes two to make a record. An average of the dashes in both directions must be taken to determine her speed. The electric eye timing devices clock her as she breaks out of the measured mile. Then back she comes for her northward run. The news headlines tell the story. A new record of better than 178 miles per hour, the fastest ever set by man on water. Biggest impact of the record run is felt on the Detroit River, home port of many of the slow-mo's rivals. For the Gold Cup race is coming up in Seattle and Gold